thank Kain you've returned. Everyone. They're all gone. My family. They've gone to war. And they're outnumbered. I fear everyone we know will be dead before the day is out. Damn the moment. My family was happy. Well, maybe not happy, but they were content. The Covenant attacked in force when they saw the signal fires. Even now, they're marching on Fort Ziren. Darj took some of the villagers there, including my men. Hold up. Captain Rana learned of a second force headed to the Balfoyan docks. She's leading a group of warriors to repel that attack, but without aid. I'm afraid you must choose. I know it's a hard choice, but you must go to the fort or the docks. Lend your strength where you think it's needed most. I don't know. Maybe I can help you talk it out. What do you want to know? I want to think so, I really do. But the Bretons are known for their magic. If they could find a way through or around the walls. I trust you. You've already saved us once. If you decide to go to Rana's aid, I know it will be the right call. I know Dalsh will win the day. Captain Rana knows her business, and she has capable people with her, including my daughter. But the docks have no walls, no defensive positions. I did. Trinhild is proud and stubborn, like her mother used to be. The Covenant flooded the docks. We tried to surrender, but they didn't want prisoners. Many of us were gutted and thrown into the sea. A few. We scattered. Some barred themselves inside, but the daggers put everything to the torch. If it wasn't for that crazy dark elf, I'd be fattening fish. You can't look for her now. Fishermen from the docks are trapped in the windmill. Rescue them before they burn. to the docks. Sane won't last long by herself. Hurry to the docks. Sane won't last long by herself. side of the docks.
I fell fighting beside Katarana. She hid me here and ran onto the ship. She's after the Covenant commander. He's the one who burned Bleak Rock. Don't let her die alone. Fight well. Kill that bastard. Commander of this vessel is the one who led the slaughter at Bleak Rock. This ship will be his grave. Below decks. Follow me. The Breton dies here. Are you ready? Good. Set it ablaze! I understand I have you to thank for driving the Covenant from these docks. The Pact owes you a debt. It's like the sun on your scales, isn't it? We almost lost these docks. All these people would have died without your intervention. Thank you. Saving lives is never a small victory. Head to Davin's watch and speak with Holgen. Make sure they've been warned about the Covenant. <laughs> I'm rather busy right now. Greetings. I'll be fine, don't worry. The surgeon will get me patched right up. Yeah! Thanks for your help back there. We're now family by blood and steel. Don't worry, I treat my family well. <laughs> Hello there. You did great, Swin. Don't worry. The healer will fix you up. She did great, didn't she?
Where'd you at for you in docks? I hear they never would have held without you. Have you come from Balfoyan? What news do you have? Yes, soldier. Thank you. We're giving the Covenant a good fight. Without your warning, Davin's watch would be in their hands. Feels good to save a city, doesn't it? The Covenant is attacking Davin's watch. The Devils bombarded the Northern District. Now they're ashore preparing to attack. I need every able hand in the battle to come. And you'll stand where you're needed. Right now, Grandmaster Tunvall Indurol's at a manor in the north of the city. He's got a smart plan, but he needs help. Follow me, or meet me there. Your choice. You'll find a manor along the north city wall. I'll be there with Tunvall. Hello there. Over here. No, I understand. If you change your mind, I'll be here. The way I see it, I'm doing you a favor. No complaints about my prices.
This place is nice, but it's not a home. Feels like I'm hiding down here. People like us, we need powerful friends if we're gonna make it in this world. Don't play coy. I see it in your eyes. You've killed people. Or you will. You've got the same urges as I do. Just between us, I hear the Dark Brotherhood is recruiting for some new blood. I'm gonna try my best to get their attention. You never heard of Tamriel's most elite guild of assassins? Rumor has it that if you take an innocent life and they notice, they'll offer you a place in the Dark Brotherhood. There, killers are free to pursue their true passion. Think about it. Word of advice. Urges aside, the Dark Brotherhood prefers to keep a low profile. Just remember, kill an innocent, get noticed. My sources say they're recruiting an anvil on the Gold Coast. I'll be at the docks there if you want to talk some more. I don't want you to do anything. I'm just providing information. Letting you know that new opportunities are available if you're willing to spill a little blood. Don't take my willingness to help out as a sign or anything. I recognized a kindred spirit and suggested a way to satisfy your darkest urges. They'll get you killed if you don't keep them under control. And if you don't find the right allies. Hey, I don't know exactly how they select new recruits. I'm just telling you what I've heard. Maybe you just need to be in the right place at the right time. Like Anvil. Of course, I've also heard they have eyes everywhere, so what do I know? That's one of the best things about the Dark Brotherhood. It hides in plain sight. No one knows where its headquarters is or how many members it has. Yet you can go into any library and read a book about them. It's brilliant, really. Quite a few, actually. My favorite is the Night Mother's Truth. It describes the origins of the Brotherhood, although it might all be theory and conjecture. But forget the books. Everyone knows the Brotherhood exists, and most people fear them. Fellowship, safety, and security, to name just a few. I understand there's also a steady flow of gold from all the contracts. And you get to kill people. Can you imagine a better guild to belong to? Better than picking pockets, if you ask me. I'm not one to reveal my sources, but Fat Grokal told me that he overheard Seaworthy Sarala say that there have been some mysterious murders committed on the Gold Coast. To me, nothing says Dark Brotherhood like mysterious murders. Oh, I got that from Margog the Hammer. Buy him a couple of ales and he spouts secrets like a bard spouts poetry. Just the other day, he told me that his cousin Crus killed a baker in Anvil. He received a mysterious visit that very night. You really don't know anything about the Brotherhood, do you? If they decide you're worthy enough to receive an invitation, one of their dark dignitaries shows up to deliver the news in person. It's kind of creepy, but it's also a singular honor. Well? Are you here about the job? To forestall any confusion, yes, we split the proceeds equally. And no, I will not budge on that point. You mean you aren't here about the notice? Well, allow me to explain. I need a partner for a difficult job. It pays well, but it involves travel, and there is some danger. Does that sound like the sort of thing that might interest you? I'm so glad you came along. I've chartered a ship. When you're ready, meet me there. Here, I'll mark your map. Bring some lockpicks. They sell them here if you don't have any. Oh, and wear something warm. Let's talk about details when we rendezvous. It's not that I don't trust you. I'm just... I don't think I've made a good impression in this place. That is, if you're still interested. You are, right? Of course you are. I'm only joking. I've never had a partner. I mean, on all other big jobs I've done, which I did alone, quite successfully, and most of the people I interviewed thought the rendezvous was too far away. Well, I paid for a ship in advance. I didn't realize how far I'd have to look to find a suitable partner. For the job, I mean. But we can talk about this at the docks. Let's talk about details when we rendezvous. It's not that I don't trust you.